Hello guys, in this video we will see how to create and connect to AWS instance for Windows Server 2019. This process is same for Windows 2012 or other versions. Click on services, search for EC2. Click on EC2. EC2 is nothing but Elastic Compute Cloud. See, this is the EC2 dashboard. Currently running instances are 2. Instances are same. Placement group, volumes, dedicated hosts, key pairs, security groups, elastic IPs, load balances, and snapshots. You can launch or create instance by clicking on this one or click on instances C. Then click on launch instances. See, at present I have two instances. One is for Ubuntu and another one is for Red Hat Enterprise Linux. See, it's a status. Both are running. Instance type is T2 micro. This is the public IP and this is the availability zone. I don't have elastic IPs. Now click on launch instances. Here I am giving EC2 win 2019. Then here we have these operating systems. Click on Windows. Here we have Microsoft Windows Server 2019 base and different base with containers for SQL Server 2022, 16, 22, 16 and 12. So I am going with free tier of that is Microsoft Windows Server 2019 base. Select it. This is the AMID. AMID is nothing but Amazon machine image instance type by default it has selected t2 micro if you want to change click on it see we have different options now key pair create new key pair then click on create key pair See, by default, they have selected allow RDP traffic from anywhere. And security group, it has selected create security group. Click on edit, then select this public IP, auto enable public IP. Once we have selected create security group, it is going to create launch wizard 5. You can rename it SZ for Windows. See, port for RDP is double three eight nine source type anywhere you can give customer my IP anywhere means CIDR is zero zeros here storage storage is 30 gigabytes you can give free tier customers only up to 30 if you want to add new volume click on this add new volume see here the summary number of instances one and software image or AMI that is Amazon machine image then virtual server type or instance type T2 micro security group new security group this will be replaced with this one volume 30 gigabytes then click on launch instance see it is launching instance See the details. See it has created security groups and security group role. group roles. Go to instances. Click on refresh. We see we have three instances. Before we have two. Now the third one is added. See its instance state is running. And instance type is T2 micro. We have to wait until this status checks completed. Public IP. Then other options. Okay. See. Now security group has been created with the customized one. Wait until this checks passed. 
click on refresh click on the instance id see see the instance summary this is the instance id this is the public ip private ip state host name private ip dns name public ip dns name this is the public ip dns name we haven't provided any iim role platform windows platform details also windows key pair name is this one see checks passed now click on the instance then click on connect session manager copy this public dns then from your keyboard or open command prompt then type ms tsc then provide then paste this public dns here Username is administrator. Copy this one. Password, get password. Now browse the key pair. Then select the Windows 11. Now click on decrypt password. See, this is the password. Now paste here. Then click on OK. Then click on S. See, we have successfully connected to Windows Server 2019. Let's verify whether 2019 or not. Start Server Manager. Then click on Local Server. Wait until this information pops out. See here, operating system version in Microsoft Windows Server 2019 data center. RAM is 1 GB, total disk space is 30 gigabytes. You can verify here also. This PC, see, total 30 gigabytes memory, hard disk, out of that only 12.8 gigabytes is available. Close this one. Close this one also. If you want to log off, click on start and select this one and disconnect. So, in this video, we have seen how to create or launch AWS EC2 instance for Windows Server 2019. Then, we have seen how to connect to AWS EC2 instance for Windows Server 2019. For more AWS cloud and windows videos please subscribe my channel thank you